So for anybody who loves Kubotas, this place has got tons of them. This is my new favorite place. guys we're here at Westwood Tree Services yeah, and they, or Westwood Lumber Company it's it's the same thing um, we're here because they're going to take our big red oak logs that we talked about there a couple episodes back I'll we'll put the link up here uh, they're gonna mill them down for our stair treads so uh, yeah. stick around let's see what we get into So we were just talking with Brian. He's got this kind of somewhat squared up now, but he's still basically chasing lumber out of this is what they call it, I guess. So they're just trying to uh, get all that wane squared off so that uh, when they actually do the, the cuts for the uh, actual stair treads, it uh, will be like true lumber. So uh, this is incredibly interesting. Oh, yeah, I'll get uh, three treads tread into that. You should get three yeah. Awesome. Yeah, we're just going to take half inch off the top because yeah. they're the weight of four quarter lands. Four quarter lands on all the half. Yeah. So I'll take half inch off the top. Uh, I'll cut it this way. Uh, for two reasons. That big knot, you want to capture big knots this way. Okay. So it, and hopefully it lands and it lands all on one board. Right. Because uh, if obviously if you cut that big knot like this, yeah. it's going to be all the way through. All through everything. Through everything. Yeah. Everything. yeah. That's the one reason, and the other reason is, see this split here? Yeah. That's actually not bad. I could probably flip it the other way, but it's actually not that bad. But the other end, it's a little worse. So you put it that way and try to capture it all in one. Right. Gotcha. So you don't have... So it's more laminated yeah, so you don't cracked. Have, you don't have three pieces with a split in the yeah. end. With the split, yeah. All the way down.
an awesome dog. so loud and just give you an idea I know Lisa was talking earlier probably but this place has got tons of logs here there's a lot of lumber that comes out of this place because it's wet too, right? Yeah, yeah, because this was actually yeah, even it was darker. Darker yeah. even an hour ago, right? Yeah, so like, when it's minus 10 or 15, by the time I would have finished those cuts, you'd have to put a wedge between or these. Or they'd be frozen just, together. Just, yeah, it's yeah. right back because the heat from the friction is late. Yeah. And then it just freezes again. Freezes. <laughs> yeah. Wow, they're just, they're beautiful. Yeah. Hey, Daisy, what do you think? Yeah, they're nice. Oh, just, oh, there's some hot spot here in this one. Yeah, oh, there's... look at that. So awesome. Yeah, they're going to be incredible. And you got a bit of different color variation that one, too. stuff like this oh yeah but like much bigger oh wow that's why when we do any live edge stuff we always put the crotch flat down yeah and saw with it yeah and you'll get like all sorts of swirl all that character. design in it basically yeah. wow yes we are now in the truck just getting ready to leave westwood uh, lumber services uh we had a fantastic morning out here watching them take some of the logs and mill them into lumber and it 
it's it's pretty awesome, I'm, eh? And yeah, so cool. I loved it. It was an awesome, awesome yeah. morning. Yeah. And the wood is absolutely beautiful. Like, I can't wait. I yeah, can't wait. it's it's going to be pretty incredible. So they're they're con- continuing to finish up the milling today, uh, and then it will get stickered and and air dried outside for a few weeks, and then they will stick it in the vacuum kiln, from what we understand, and then basically. I think it's only roughly two weeks or something like that in the vacuum kiln and then we'll literally have you know dried Ready lumber from those red oak logs that we can uh, then start uh, getting arranged to uh, have it used for the uh, trail uh, trail steads i say it all the time <laughs> stair treads and we're going to have lots of other lumber left over that we can do some other projects with so it was great just want to give a shout out to uh, uh, brian and then brad both from Westwood Tree Services and Westwood Lumber. Um, these guys are great guys. If you need any, you know, tree work done, you need any milling done. They also have like a design thing with lumber. Like, great bunch of guys. Uh, don't be afraid to reach out to them. So uh, for now, you'll see not as much talking in this video as normal because there's a lot of milling. So. Uh, Thanks for watching the channel. Hit the thumbs up. Share the video with your friends. Hit the little bell so you know when we post our next video. And uh, I see guess you next time. We'll see you next time. Have a good day.